It is a non-woven fabric with a fusion of plastic material. For our use we have selected thicknesses 0.5, 0.7 and 0.9 mm, all thermo-adhesive. The temperature and pressure time for coupling depend from the material on which it is applied but also from the type of press available. The material can easily be cut by hand. In this case we chose the largest thickness, 0.9 mm. Like most used reinforcements, it has a cutting direction to respect. The yield follows the width while the tension follows the length of the roll. The test demonstrates its application with a calf leather, a synthetic material coated with polyurethane and microfiber support, a snake-like printed skin and finally, satin, one of the most difficult materials to treat due to the weaving system. The merger of the reinforcement, as we note, has not damaged in any of the cases the natural elasticity and tension of the materials. After heart lamination, the double thickness obtained is easily trimmed and, after a good skimming, it is possible to proceed with the bending of the edge using traditional glues. Above all, however, it is necessary to note that despite the low thickness, Stardex has an excellent consistency of the clean cut, so it is suitable for use as a guideline to create a folded edge of excellent quality. Also the trimming of materials of other nature, as the images show, it is achieved without particular problems. In case it is necessary to dye the edges trimmed net of the model, the quality of this reinforcement allows treatment with traditional liquid products used in leather goods, during the lamination test we recreated both situations and the result produced. The first half of the component in which the plastic material has completely melted and therefore made reinforcement useless, and a second half where the temperature was too low, so after a very short time time the material is detached causing blows and wrinkles both on natural leather and on synthetic material. In this second example of use we want to show that the Stardex you can wear it normally. We are building a prototype of a leather document booklet fully reinforced with this heat adhesive material. The first operation consists, as always, in coupling the two previously scarce thicknesses. The edges of the cover and of the applied pockets are folded. Therefore, after the melting, a layer of traditional adhesive must be applied, used in leather goods for this purpose. The physical characteristics of elasticity and tension do not change, despite the plastic layer that has penetrated perfectly between the fibers. The seams of the traditional assembly are executed without unexpected problems, as there could be thread breaks or inaccurate needle puncturing. At the end of the construction of the object we notice the softness and the memory of flexibility, as we would have expected despite the thermoplastic fusion, 